हेलो नॉलेज सीकर्स दिस इज शो मैन फ्रॉम ऑयल एंड गैस फील्ड क्वालिटी कंट्रोल टाइप्स ऑफ कोटिंग एंड रैपिंग विल डिस्कस वन बाय वन इन ब्रीफ विथ सम फोटोज एंड डिस्क्रिप्शन द सेकेंड कैटेगरी हियर इज एपॉक्सी कोटिंग ए बी ए बी मीन्स फ्यूशन बॉन्डेड एपॉक्सी एपॉक्सी इज ए टाइप ऑफ पॉलीमर ए ग्रुप ऑफ केमिकल कॉम्पोनेंट्स दैट कंसिस्ट ऑफ लार्ज मॉलिक्यूल्स विथ रिपीटिंग सब यूनिट्स we know that the molecular structure of the polymers gives them their toughness and elasticity making polymer products seen everywhere in daily life epoxy resins include epoxides highly reactive group of molecules that harden or cure through chemical reactions which are caused either by combining them with other substances or heating them to a high temperature this is the process through which an epoxy becomes cross-linked as polymer stands form into a hardened structure the property of epoxies is used in fusion bonded epoxy coating over pipes to provide long term corrosion resistance and protection of the pipes under moderate operating temperature it can be uh, range from 30 degree centigrade to 110 degree centigrade the resin and hardener components in the dry powder a b stock remain unreacted at normal storage conditions at typical coating application temperatures which are generally in a range of 180 degree centigrade to 250 degree centigrade the contents of the powder melt and transform to a liquid form the liquid a b film wets and flows onto the steel surface on which it is applied and soon becomes a solid coating by chemical cross linking assisted by heat this process is known as fusion bonding it is bonded when it is fused by heat the chemical cross linking reaction taking place in this case is irreversible once the curing takes place the coating cannot be returned to its original form by any means the application of further heating also does not melt the coating thus it is known as thermoset coating how the ab coating applied to the pipe the systematic sketch will provide you the production process of a b coated pipe first we need to preheat the pipe then we need to blast it to be cleaned then grind surface defects if any then surface preparation is being done before applying the coating then we will start the final surface treatment then induction heating is being done if it is for the pipe we need to put it inside an oven where the full oven is preheated before application if it is for the only the girth well localized induction heating coil is being used so after the application which is sprayed over the pipe when the pipe is heated then we need to give some curing time to the pipe then we will quench it on the water after that electrical inspection or holiday testing being done to check if there is any um, adhesion issue between the pipe and the coating finally the stain sealing the pipe markings are posted by the painting contractor before dispatching it to the site the third one is dual layer fusion bonded epoxy coating this is also a b but dual layer this is a variant of a b coat where instead of a single layer of a b coat there is one more layer of a b is added for added protection the first layer is called a corrosion protective layer the layer is of fusion bonded epoxy which offers very excellent corrosion protection the fusion bonded epoxy has very excellent bonding with the blasted steel surface and the layer 2 consists of a coating either fusion bonded epoxy or it could be a polyurethane polyester or some other coating this abrasion resistance overcoat protects the base coat of ab from abrasion and also from the physical damage hope you have some overview knowledge share and subscribe my channel if you like the way of my teaching signing off for today showman